Wish me luck. No, I think that's going to work. I think that's going to work. Let's go with this, then. Don't know where it's going to put us, but let's get back in. Ah, what a start. You've never had either of those problems? I feel like you've missed out with, like, some flying corpses. It, when did it start? It started halfway through my playthrough. Probably about 20 hours in, some, somewhere in Velen. I think. That's where the problem started. And I just remember... The, I just remember noticing that people were jumping about and flying all over the place. So, well, it looks like we're not too far to go anyway, so that's alright. So we've got the necrophage oil back on. We shall try not to going? die this time. Damn, hang on. Hang on, I just need to set that to be the active quest. Which I can do from the world map. Yes. Nice. I can't play without that. That is just so helpful. Right, so we put that back on. Okay, well I got what I wanted because I wanted to I wanted it to crash so that it would reaffirm that it wasn't the mod that was the problem. That's that's kind of cool. Kind of cool. I you see what I did there. Smell a card. Hang on, let's set some stuff on fire. Uh, watch out for devourers this time as well. Ah, there's one, there's one, there's one. Right, I'm not falling for that. Why can't I? Oh, my, uh... Can't see. Did he just die? I maybe just killed him, did I? In one good slash. No, no, I see he's lurking in there. Get out, get out, get out. I'm not, I'm not doing this again. No, I'm not. No, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I can hit him. Once. Quen. Quen. Nope. No! No, no. No, no. <laughs> well, the guards are now dead. Right, let's also put that on. What a mess that was. Utter, utter mess. Yeah, I don't know whether the, the, the fact that I've got flying corpses is in any way related to the fact that I'm also having weird crashes. Occasional weird crashes. Look at the stuff in here. Poor dead guys. Actually, they might have done better if I hadn't come in and helped. It's saying I've got something on me, is it above? Must be... Maybe below. Wait, have I missed a hole? Aha! Oh, wait, this is going back out. This is not where I want to be. But I will get that Demetrium ore that's in that, uh, that one. Bit of pure silver. Tasty. Failed the quest as one of them died, so no money. Ah, oh, no money for me. That's a good point. It's gone. Never mind. We'll clean this place out anyway. Still, we're fighting devourers. I died. I can't exactly hold them too responsible. And it would have been a hard job, I think, to... What the hell? The Algul. The Algul. Ow! Right. Learn. And hit it. Now. Did it go down? It did. Ah, that's what we're after. Loot. There's my reward. There's my cash. Oh, crap. There's some more. Pig hides and rubies. And even more. Nice. Oh, well, that wasn't a too bad a reward, actually, in the end. Oh, I wonder if they're outside, actually. Upstairs, above. 
It looks, it does look that way. Ah, yep, those devourers. They are the bane of my playthrough. Go, go. So we need to check on the next quest, actually. There's, there is Yennefer over there, right? Yep. But there's also this ambush strange beast contract, which we'll do right here. I know I only played for the, without the map mod for about 40 minutes, but yeah, I missed it. I did, I missed it in that time. Right, let's see what's going on. Mm, something really did tear him to pieces. So, not just like a... Oh. Get the loot, and then we check the clues. Looks like blood, but... Hmm. Red clay. That means nothing to me. Hmm. Not much left. Beast must have dragged the shredded body to the woods. Creature leading the Neckers is sentient. Gotta be capable of setting primitive traps, at least. That's not good. That's not good at all. Okay, and you? Nice to see you. Glad to hear you're over your your dental um, dental pain and uh, what's the, what's the word I'm looking for? Tracks lead into the woods. Dental encounter. Anyway, welcome back. Uh, catch you on the next one. Hopefully, I'm streaming outward more on Friday night with Aimless. If you're around, otherwise, uh, maybe catch you over the weekend or which next week. Have a good one. Anyway. Ah, that wasn't far. There's a great, dirty, great big hole here. Found a good place for their nest. Yeah, let's let's save before jumping in that. <coughs> oh, it's this. Way! <laughs> I pulled out a burning torch into a smoky cloud of flammable gas, and then got blown into the next cloud of flammable gas. That's the way to do it. Hang on, let's put some Ogroid oil on. That was pretty class, actually. Uh, is it the orange one? It was. Nice guess. <coughs> nope, no, 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 no. Nope, there's more. Crap, there's more of it. <laughs> right, I'm going to use Ard on that in the future. Because that is a little bit, uh, little bit dangerous. <laughs> but it's good. In fact, I think we might need a clip or two of that. Slightly more flammable than I was expecting. <laughs> right, let's just clear the gas. I'll leave the explosive torch. And we shall use some cat potion. We'll do this properly. One down. I hope we found a nasty necker behind us. Finally, the main nest. Is that? I couldn't tell if that was. Oh, nice! Instant death from being on the floor. Don't you slap me, horrible little gribbly. Any more? What we got then? Something horrible? It's behind you. What the hell is that? Uh, guess I got company. It's a it's a what? A hag goblin? I thought it said hobgoblin for me. Oi, where do you think you're going? Oh, he's got some mates, has he? Where are you going? Come back here, girl. Hang on, let's get some swing on. 
or whirl or whatever it's called. Missed. Missed. Twice. Oof. Quite good, even if it does look like it's going to get me killed. Run out of the way a minute. Some more down. Where's his mate gone? Ooh, he hits hard. Look at his neckers. There. Clean them out. Oh, I was hoping to... I was hoping to set them on fire, but um, a little bit out of stamina. Wow, that was a nest full of crap. No mistake. More fire. That's what we need, Pedro. Definitely need more fire. Never got to try it on the big guy. And I've got to be careful using Whirl that much because that is, uh, it's good when it works. But it's so easy to whirl yourself into the middle of enemies thinking you're going to kill them and then take a ton of damage. We've got some more Neckers. So I just got a ton of Mutagens and Claws off that lot. Mutagens, I guess, might be useful. Is there nothing I can loot down here? Big chest. No, it doesn't seem to be. Oh, whoa. He says, hang on, no, I've done that guy, right? Yeah. Where the hell was that ledge? I would put the torch on so I can see where I'm going, but I don't want to go running into another gas cloud like this. Oh, quick, get him, get him, get him, eyes down. Yes. <laughs> that does look so cool. Seems the Neckers have developed an immunity to the toxin. <laughs> now the poison protects their nest. Clever. Hmm. Never said that before. And so, we emerge. Tempted to see what that is at the top, but it... Probably makes more sense just to go steaming back down the hill. We're just there. We're just there. Let's go and take a look. Mutagens are useful in blood and wine, so hang on to them for now. Yeah, I haven't sold any yet. Uh, I've, I've, I used to make them all into greater mutagens for the uh, slotting with the powers and stuff. I haven't done that for a bit, because I think I've maxed out on what I need for those. But, um, yeah, I haven't certainly haven't sold any. This is a cool-looking fort. Is it empty? Odd place for a waterfall. A bite. Just one morsel. <laughs> One piece a crumb uh, uh, food uh, food That sounds like me <coughs> Shite not not again not again hmm. I think I need to find out what's going on with this dude Can I go in? Key required. Maybe I can just leap over the wall. A few monsters in there. A wolf. I kind of feel like there's a story to this, and I maybe don't want to kill everyone. What the hell is this? Or is it a quest have I stumbled Blood. upon? Human. 
Okay. What the hell is that? What is going on here? Kind of glad we came running over here because this looks interesting. <laughs> well, I have to pick that up. Have it. Although, having said that, there might have been a contract out for this guy or something, but... That's locked as well, eh? Right. I guess maybe I'm not supposed to come here just yet. Plenty of wolves. I could kill the wolves, but... There's a clue there of some sort. At some point, I really do hope there's a need for these 100,000 gallons of dog tallow that I've picked up over the course Human of this game. Blood. Lots of it. Deep wound must have been. Is that a door over there? Human blood. Lots of it. Deep wound must have been. You'll be back here with Yen? Oh, okay. The fact that everything's locked does, does sort of suggest that I should probably come back here later. But still, I do like to explore a little. Can't get it out from this end? No. Yep. <laughs> Good jump. How the hell do I get out of this? We're going for it. We're going for it. Straight over the wall. Uh. <laughs> that was taking my life in my hands. Oh, nice though. Nice. We've got um, fast travel and alchemy supplies up this lane. How did I find out about that? This is Mork Bag. Hey, Indigo. How are you doing, by the way? Freya, hear my prayer. Freya, grant my plea. Yes, one more week, Carisu. I know you feel better. Welcome to the Temple of Freya. I'm Kirisu. How can I help? You a novice? Because I'd never take you for a priestess. Truly? Hmm, you've got a good eye. Though a bit off in this case. I'm neither a priestess nor a novice. I escaped a pirate ship, was wounded. That's why I'm here. Hmm. Sisters Astrid and Dala found me on the beach, near dead. They brought me to the temple, watched over me. I owe them my life. Quite the adventure. Got a home to go back to, or will you stay here? I've a brother in Ord Skellig. He's surely mad with grief searching for me. Once I'm better, all better, I'll find a longship and head home. Is it just modern life, or this game, that's made me doubt the story of any single character I meet anywhere? You're doing fine, go. Good, glad to hear it. I'm, I'm doing alright, just had a busy day rushing around today, and I might have to Cut the stream a little early, probably about half five or so. It's my uh, my mother's birthday today, so uh, I've got a little bit of um, stuff to see to later. <laughs> Present to wrap and stuff like that. You found the Morkvag quest bloody annoying trying to work out what the hell to do? Oh, thanks. That's that's gonna something for me to look forward to then. So long. Also, I don't know if you guys can hear that. Helicopter going overhead. Actually, that's not a helicopter. But I can definitely hear a helicopter in the background as well. Why does the goddess bring you here? Brought myself here, seems to me. You do not worship Freya. No, but I respect those that do, including her priestesses. This does you credit, but is meaningless as well. I'll stuff you. For Freya rewards and punishes those of other faiths and infidels as she does her own. Worship her and it will help, though it will settle nothing. What do you need? A shop. That's it. Nothing. Nothing else. Maybe. Tell me something about this temple, could you? It happened once that Freya lost her favourite white cat. 
She scoured the aisles and finally found him here. Freya's heart filled with joy and she blessed this place. A temple was then established here. Didn't know Freya was into cats. Your ignorance speaks poorly of you. The white cat is the goddess's sacred animal and has deep symbolic significance. This temple is for those who seek Freya's help in finding what they desperately seek. Perhaps even you shall experience her grace. Scorn her not, or have you friends so powerful that you can afford to spurn divine aid? Almost. Mind if I have a look at your wares? Is that it? I was hoping there'd be something rather... Actually, what are those books? Travel Between Worlds book. Yeah, I'm not that interested. I'm trying to think of any of these things. Were we short of anything? Probably. That's kind of disappointing, but... That is... Nope, she doesn't sell those cordials. That's what I needed. Don't suppose I can make anything. Any more oils? What's that stuff? It all needs white gull. That's, that's kind of where I'm stuck. Farewell. You can't stand... You mostly can't stand religion, especially preachers trying to manipulate others. Yep, I'm with you there. I dare say we might go into that later on. The temple, that is. Not the deep, dark topic of religion. <laughs> What's this one over here? Wolf's clothing? Talk to the priestess about Morkbarg. Ah, uh, well. It is kind of on the way. Let's do it. Leave those chanting morons behind. This is like a... Whoa, 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 careful. This is like a really nice landscape. Run across through here and explore. Uh, I love that. That's what I really like. Little, little streams like that. They look so good. The hell was that noise? Just a wolf, right? A wraith. Ow. Wraiths are nasty. Can we get some? In fact, I might even use a little bit of spectre oil for this. Just to speed this up. You coming? You coming? Yeah, mistake. Mistake. Mistakes were made. Mastercrafted racing saddle, I wonder. I think I've got a better one, but let's just take a quick look. Fifty-five is that all? Fifty-five stamina for that? I would have thought. Sounds better, but it's not. Still we can sell it. Bit of cold hard cash never goes amiss. Morgan. Lofferton. What are you gonna do in this big house? They're not coming back. Seems he did not come to pray. Instead of fixing it, move it. Who are we talking me? to here? Larvic. Greetings. Can I have a word? I am here to serve pilgrims who have come to venerate the goddess. Mine's more an earthly matter. What is it? Word is you've got a problem. Morkvarg. That's its name. Could tend to it for you. Do so, and you will greatly please the goddess. That's nice and all, but coins what <laughs> pleases me. That's we my boy. Type. Fret not, I shall pay. But only if you rid us of Morkvarg, once and for all. There have been those who have killed Morkvarg, but a curse has brought him back each time. Okay. Never heard of this Morkvarg. What is it exactly? Not what. Who. 
The worst man Skellige has ever known. He held nothing sacred, raided the lands of his own clan, took gold from Nilfgaard, murdered women heavy with child, and children he... Mm -hmm. I know the type. They said he feared but one thing, albeit secretly, the wrath of the gods. Morkvarg decided to prove everyone, himself included, wrong. So he came to Hindisvya to raid the goddess's garden. This was years ago. Raid the goddess's garden? Archpriestess Ulva stood in his path. He stabbed her in the breast and cast her into the mud. So. As her blood gushed forth, she cursed Morkvarg. And he transformed into a monster. Gotta be a euphemism. Gotta be. Raid the goddess's garden. <laughs> the internet has ruined me. Oh, I cannot be innocent ever again. The internet has just destroyed me. Notice I read didn't mention a curse. All who live here know of it. Could be, but I'm not from around here. Could use some information. Archpriestess Olva cast the curse. Mm -hmm, so you said. It bound Morkvarg to the garden for all time. So even if he is killed, he returns there. So we need to break this curse. Uh, oh, can I get back to that other topic of Never conversation? Heard of this Morkvarg. What is Not what? Yeah, we've the done that bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They said he. Fi Ar okay, this one. Might have already run into this Morkvarg. Yeah. Werewolf? I know not. I... I'm afraid I've never seen him. Shame, that. Was hoping you could tell me more about him, help me with my work. You might speak with Toradar's son, Einar. He saw Morgfarg and his men descend on the garden. He was the sole pilgrim to escape with his life that day. Settled in Larvik, you'll find him at the landing there, provided he's not at sea. Now that would be inconvenient, if he was. Farewell. The goddess protect you from all evil. Northern prayer is patient, but she brooks no insult. <coughs> okay, nothing else to do here. No taverns full of bawdy wenches and slavering drunkards. This looks like a really crap place to uh, to hang out, actually. If it wasn't for the internet, it would have been specialist magazines that would have fueled a filthy mind. <laughs> the sort of magazines that you used to have to go looking under hedges for. That type of magazine are you referring to? Uh, what have we got? So, I can back to Freya's garden. But we want to go back to Larvik to talk to that dude. I'm going to do these before moving on, otherwise we're going to get uh, trapped between the quests. So, it's fast travel to Larvik from here. As tempting as it is, now we've got the mop, the mop, the map markers back. You think, oh, I'll just do these while I'm in the area, but we're going to follow the quest lines and uh, actually complete them that way. So whilst we're on the topic, we're going to go and do it. But I'm just going to go and hand in the uh, the money one here first, which should be. It must be on the way out of the village. I'm sure it is. Guy, he's not going to show up. Is that him? Was it Thorleaf? It was. So will you help then? It's dead. Killed the beast that was troubling you. Merciful Freya. Horson's finally dead. <laughs> now, tell us, was it a tough fight? Got any wounds need dressing? No, I'll be all right. Ah, uh, nothing new to the likes of you. Hard work, witchering. All right. Your reward. This hair's for you. Thanks. So long. What the hell was it that I killed, anyway? Winds howling. Was it the thing in the uh, ghoul nest? Was that the one? 